Hey everyone, it's Simplicity, and welcome back to part two of our first day of the hard mode challenge. So I decided it's only been, I don't know, maybe like a half an hour since I stopped filming the last part. And I decided, you know what, I want to film. I want to see if I can pay off this tent with the 5,000 miles and just kind of, you know, play for a little bit. Um... I won't be filming, as I mess up a fish, but I won't be filming this entire, like, hard mode challenge, like, step by step, um, just because I don't feel like that's all that entertaining, I don't know, but I figured, you know, we'll play the first day, because either way, I feel like this is kind of good for people that are just getting into Animal Crossing. Um, even if they're not doing the hard mode challenge, because you can kind of see, like, oh, this is how you can pay off, like, your house loan and all of that stuff. So, I feel like it's not too bad. But let's see if we can catch a fish. Um, I messed that up and clicked the button too early. My reflexes are apparently not good for fish today. <laughs> Um, alright, well, let's just kind of keep going, see if we can find any more fish. We got Tommy out here, uh, resident services open at night, out checking to see how everyone's doing. Yeah, okay. Oh, look, a fish! Okay, let's see. If I can at least catch one fish, I will be happy. I promise, I'm not normally this bad at fishing. Oh, uh, this is a pond smelt, which we already had, so that'll be going to my beach, and there goes my fishing rod. So we're gonna have to run around and go and get some more, but we did just get some nook miles, so we have the trashed tools. Was that really the first one that's broke on me? Okay, so the next one is 20, so it's gonna take us a little bit to get there, but we will get there eventually, but we're gonna run around, pick up some sticks, um... Maybe shake a couple of trees, see if they have any sticks. And just see if we can, you know, make another fishing rod. We need one more. Does this tree, thank you, I was going to say, does this tree have one more to give me? It does. And then I also have to run around and clean up my weeds, but I think I'm going to do like a full weed cleaning day once I get the vaulting pole. Um, because then I can go ahead and clean up every single weed on my island all at once. I do also have to do the tape deck. I have not done a stretching session today yet. So let's go ahead and we will do that together. Why not? Because I believe it is in the rules that you have to stretch every day. So for day one, we will go ahead and stretch. I'll do it with buttons. And we will hang out and do a little bit of a stretch together. So here's a good reminder. Um, if you have not yet already, go and get some water, a snack, stretch, take your medication, do whatever you need to do that's going to allow you to take care of yourself. And if you want to partake in this little stretch, why not? Go ahead, stretch your body, rotate your arms, and get your body moving. But we're just going to go ahead and keep on doing this here. Look at how cute Agnes is. Are you kidding? Why is she so cute? I think I might be a little bit obsessed with Agnes, and I don't know how. I have never had her on an island before. Like, if she ever asks to leave, I'm going to be kind of sad. But I think she's going to be the one that I want to build up a relationship with, a, like, friendship with, and get her picture. So, she might be sticking around on the island for a little bit of time. Alright, so now we gotta rotate the body. Just kinda, you know, stretch, stretch, stretch. And do it one more time. And we'll go again this way. And now we've got some jumping jacks. So let's go ahead and jump, jump, jump. Alright, sorry if you can hear the sound in the background. My, um, what is it called? My phone is just turned on. Because, for those of the, you that don't know, I am Canadian, so winter is kind of a little bit chilly. So, you know, 
there's not much I can do about that part, unfortunately, but hopefully it's not too loud. But there we go. We have completed our first ever stretch on this island. So let's go ahead and head into resident services. And we can go ahead and make another fishing rod. See if we can maybe go ahead and catch some more fish. All right. I need to go ahead and actually get myself a my own workbench at some point, but for now I don't mind. Okay. Make this little fishing rod here. And there we go. So we have made a fishing rod. We are done. I don't need anything else. I am going to actually talk to Tom Nook just really quickly, just to see if there's anything he wanted me to do. Uh, thank you for finding a place for blabbers. Okay, so yeah, he wants our move-in fees. One way is to garden. Why are you screaming at me? All right. Well, what did I just get? Did I unlock the stretching one? Is that what it is? So if I plant five more flowers, I can go ahead and get some more stuff. Um, that I need like five more fish. Cast Master, I think it's going to be the one that takes me a while. Um, this one I can go ahead and take a picture. Edit credit, I think it's passport. Yes. So those are easy to do. The bulletin board I will do off camera. Um, also same with first custom design because I have to kind of teach myself custom designs with this. So if we come over to my passport, we can quickly do that. Um... I think I'm going to edit my title. I didn't mean to click on comment, but I think I want to edit my title. So what do we have as an option? Uh, let's see. Don't really love all these, but maybe we could do like deserted island camper, I guess, for right now. Because that'll at least get us some points, and that's kind of what we need right now. So, very quick, let's get this. It's not going to be worth a whole lot, but we are now over the halfway point, so I guess that's what matters most. And we will go ahead and head on out, see if we can maybe catch some more fish, and just try and get as many nook miles as we possibly can today. Um, I'm going to go ahead and hold my little fishing rod here, and we're going to go ahead and run around, do some fishing, because, you know, why not? Um... That reminds me, I need to go ahead and place you down over here. And we have a little message in a bottle over here as well. So I'll go ahead and pick that up. But let's go ahead and see if I can catch this fish really quick. That was nowhere close to the fish. Um, let's try that one more time. See if we can catch the fish. Okay. Alright, so we have officially caught a fish that ended up being a lock. So I guess we didn't necessarily catch a fish at all. But I'm going to go ahead and open my message bottle. So this one is from Annalise. And we now have a wooden table mirror. So that's not a bad DIY. It's not going to benefit me quite yet. But I feel like that's not a bad one to start out with. Um, so we're just going to go ahead and, you know, kind of run around a little bit more. We've got a fish over here in the river. So let's go ahead and cast and see what we... Are you kidding? Well, that was just kind of rude, the fish. Um, try that again. Oh my goodness. This fish does not want to be caught. All right, one more time here. Let's see if we can catch this fish. And it didn't register me clicking the button. So that's fun. All right, so we have a tiny little fish over here. Hopefully we are able to go ahead and catch that one. Because I have come to conclusion that I cannot fish whenever I'm trying to film, for whatever reason. Um, I don't know. I don't know what it is. But I'll have to do the cast master off screen, I guess, because whatever it is, I cannot fish. Alright, well, this is a little bit unfortunate. Okay. I promise I'm not normally this bad at fishing. I'm using the little, um... I don't actually know what it's called. The, like, controller that comes with your Switch that you can, like, plug your Joy-Cons into. And it has a little bit of, like, a delay for some reason. 
So maybe I'll try filming next time without using this and just holding my Joy-Cons and seeing if that makes any sort of difference when we try to catch fish. But right now, this fish does not want to bite. Can we... There we go. We caught his attention. So what kind of fish do we have over here? There we go. I caught a fish. A uh, yellow perch, I think. Yes. So we now have another new fish to go to the museum. And we're just going to kind of, you know, keep running around. This is another fish. I'm going to only assume that it's a sea bass. I feel like that's only the right assumption whenever it comes to a fish of this size over here. That it is typically a sea bass. And I was wrong. Uh, this is a olive flounder. So we now have another new fish and some more nook miles. So we have now caught 10 different fish. So we are slowly but surely getting close to the 3000 mark. We do still have a little while to go, but we can, you know, we will try. Um, ideally, like, I would love to be able to start on the cast master today, because I know that's going to be one that takes a while. That was my own fault there. But I know that's going to be one that takes a while, but at the same time, I don't know if I have the patience. <laughs> so I guess we'll see how it goes. Um, let's go ahead and try this one more time. I promise I'm not going to just spend all the time fishing, but we just caught another dab, so that's going to end up going into our CJ donation pile. Um, there is actually a fish over here in my little pond, but I want to very quickly go ahead and place the yellow perch down over here. Sophie is playing Animal Crossing, so we will go ahead and place this down, but yeah, I'm filming this pretty close to the point that Sophie streams at, so if you're watching this, hi Sophie, but I'm filming this on, you know, very close to the stream time. Alright, so Tank is killing a little bundle of wood. Um, we've got a tiny little fish over here. Alright, that was actually like a perfect cast for once in my life. And an anchovy. Honestly, that's kind of making me miss anchovy the villager. Okay, place these down. We're just going to have a little kind of, you know, fish collection going on over here on my beach. Um, we have another little fishy. I so wish that I could get that money spot. I would love to be able to get that started, but I don't have a shovel yet. Um, can I just catch this fish? Apparently not, because I don't know how to cast in the right direction. Alright, one, two, and we have a squid! Thank you for that, Sophie. I'm going to consider that Sophie luck, because for those of you who don't know, um, Sophie is a friend of mine. She is a Twitch streamer. But she's got a little squid hat, so the fact that she just popped up in the corner, and then now I caught a squid, feels like it's only, you know, destined to be. But let's go ahead and run around. Alright. We've got another fish back here. Let's, that's I was going to say it's definitely not in this right spot. Um, and the fish now moved. So, I'm going to try and do this a little bit more this way. Alright, there we go. Two, three, four, and I messed it up. Alright, that's fine. I have come to the conclusion that me catching fish on camera is a little bit of a whole mess. And that I'm definitely not going to end up getting cast master this way. But, that's alright. Um, I'll be able to do it at some point, hopefully. But, I just want to go ahead and capture some fish and I messed it up again. But, yeah. There's not really, like... I feel like a lot of early gameplay is kind of just grinding to get those nook miles. Um, I know I can sell seashells. There's a present that I wish that I could get. But, I'm going to actually head over here to Resident Services. 
And I think I'm going to go ahead and see if I can buy some flowers from, is it Timmy that's inside? I'm going to see if I can get some flowers from him that I can go ahead and plant. Because I do want to have a few little, you know, things around the island. So let's see. We're still setting up, but we have a small selection. And we have to buy something from them every day, right? I think it's one thing per day. So a candle and a handy water cooler are not going to get me very far. Um, we do have some recipes. Okay, I'm going to go with the slingshot recipe. Why is it not letting me buy anything? Huh. That's weird. Um, yeah, I don't know what's going on. Because I am definitely, like, selecting it. If I say thanks, if there's any, like, to purchase, we can do business later. Da, 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 da. We'll pay you a little bit for weeds. Well, I can't sell you any of my weeds. So, that's a little unfortunate. But, let's see. If I click on what's for sale, can I get a slingshot now? Actually, let's do DIY for beginners first. 480 bells. I'll buy it. Okay. Uh, time to send the recipes to your phone. Alright. And we're done. I hope you enjoy DIY even more now with your new recipes. Um, I would also like the slingshot. So let's go ahead and get that here really quick as well. For another 300 bells. Okay. And then I'm also going to go ahead and see what we have for flowers. We have yellow roses. Orange windflowers, red mums. Let's get the orange windflowers. Because I already have the red mums on my island. And my native flower, I believe, are roses. So, I definitely don't need any more. Okay. So, I know I just, like, bought three things. But, I'm going to do what I can to kind of help me out here. Um, so, for Nook Miles. So, we got the first time buyer. So there's some more little nook miles here. And that looks to be it for right now. So I'm going to come over here and we're going to go ahead and plant those flowers. Actually, let me learn my slingshot really quickly. Perfect. So there is another useful tool. And then let's go ahead and plant the orange wind flowers over here. I actually quite like the wind flowers. Um, the orange ones are more so specifically my favorite color wind flower, but I do enjoy them. So, now we have some more Nook Miles for some more flowers, which is always quite nice. There we go. So, we have 10 flowers. So, we now need, like, less than 1,500 to go. Um, that I'm nowhere close. So, we're going to have to skip that. Uh, we need, like, two more fish. Like, new fish to get that one. Um... Uh, bugs aren't going to really help us out there either. Okay. I don't have that. If I break one more tool, then we can get some more. Or is that making a tool? I think that was making one. So what is the recipe for the slingshot? A bunch of hardwood. Well, I can do that. Uh, switch over here to my little axe. Here we are. So let's go ahead and hit some trees with my axe. See if we can collect some wood. Because I believe I also get a nook mile for wood. So that's kind of helping us out as well. So let's just go ahead and see what we can collect. Um, I don't think I'm collecting anything here because of all the weeds. So, you know, just clean this up a little bit. Can I hit the tree some more? And I broke my axe. So... That didn't get us very far. Alright, well, we did get a little bit of wood. Um, what was... That was just unlocking a new thing. What is the recipe for an axe? We need some tree branches. Okay, so it looks like there's actually a little piece of wood back here. But can I go ahead and shake you for some tree branches so that I'm able to go ahead and make another axe? And we know there's no wasps in this tree, so that's definitely helpful. There we go. So let's go ahead and collect all of the tree branches. We will go ahead and run and get another axe. And see if we can, you know, go ahead and collect some more wood. Because I would love 
to have a slingshot. I feel like that's definitely going to be very beneficial. We can see what the sky gives us because I know the sky sometimes help us, helps with like money. Uh, sometimes you can get some good materials. So let's go ahead and craft here. We will make an axe. All right, speed this up. There we go, all done for now. And we are gonna go ahead and run around and get some more wood. Uh, what was... Oh, perfect, okay. So we just got 300 more miles for that. All right, so if I felt like bulk crafting, I could, but I'm gonna actually really quickly take a picture because I do get nook miles for this too. Um, honestly, this picture is probably not gonna be used for anything, but you know, I may as well get this done. Lovely Tom Nook over there. But there we go, we took a couple of pictures. So we can get a few more Nook Miles. Okay. So now we are less than 900. So it is, does slowly but surely add up. Um, Hoard reward. Indoor furniture. I need like two more things. So I think, I don't know actually if these count. The switch and the picture. Do they count as indoor furniture? Because I can go ahead and place them in my tent if they do. I may as well go ahead and test that out. And, you know, apparently run into trees. But, I was gonna say, I don't entirely remember where my tent is. Alright, let's see. See if I can place these inside and how it goes. But I actually quite like my little camping cot. I feel like I have a very cute pattern. So, if I place this, like, here. And I place this over here. Okay, so those don't count. Did neither of them count? Um, what one was that? Was it this one? Okay, so neither of those counted. That's fine. Um, I'm gonna leave them here anyways, just because then I'm not... Actually, I guess it doesn't really matter. Um... What can I do? I want to see... I know I need to make a slingshot, but is there anything in here? We don't really have any like good DIYs right now for furniture inside. Um, so let's go ahead and take a look, see what else we have. Um, this one I still haven't gotten anywhere because I cannot catch fish for the life of me today. Um, bell ringer, spending 5,000. Yeah, I don't have that. All right, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and really quickly Maybe right on my bulletin board just to get us some points. But it's not going to be anything fancy and then I'll probably fix it up like off camera. So let's run up here and design a little bulletin board. Okay, so I went ahead and I designed a little thing on my bulletin board. Um, it's not going to be the one that stays, but there we go. We at least have some more Nook Miles. Um, what else can I do? I don't know what other ones I can really, like, focus on right now. Like, I can go ahead and see if we can catch some bugs, but snowflakes also kind of take over the spot of bugs right now. So that's a little unfortunate. Um, there's a fish. So... I don't know what I want to do. I could see if we can maybe find a wasp. Get stung by a wasp. See if we can, you know, get something for that. We got some bells. So I'm not going to complain about that too much. Um, but yeah, I'm not going to try and catch my first wasp. I'm going to try and get stung by it because then I can also get the recipe for medicine. So I know I think it's two that you need to have to be able to get Nook Miles from it. But, you know, we can try. Um, this is called I Don't Know What Trees I've Done and What Ones I Haven't Done Already. So, some of these trees I may have already done. I'm just going to kind of, you know, aimlessly kind of run around. Alright. Let's see. Ooh, some more bells. I am not complaining that the trees are giving me bells. Alrighty. 
keep this going with a little present over here. Which I could have got if I had made the slingshot by now. Oh, there's a wasp nest. Okay. I don't think I have the gamer skills and able to do this. But I can try. Yeah, no. <laughs> I didn't think so. Oh, well. We were just stung by a wasp. Oh. Aren't we cute with the eye that looks like a little cracker? Alright, well, we'll pick up the wasp nest. Can I talk to you? Will you give me medicine? Take some medicine and then get better. So, no? I guess I don't have any space in my inventory. Uh, drop the snowflake. And then if I talk to you again, do you do anything? No. So I guess I'm going to have to go and see if I can find Agnes. And if she will help me out with some medicine. Um, she's over here. Oh. I didn't mean to do that, I'm sorry. Um, it's too late to be careful. If I had medicine with me, I'd give it to you, but I can show you how to make medicine. You know what? That's fine. I will take the recipe. It's pretty easy to make medicine, so I will learn that recipe. Um, okay. And there we go. So we at least now have another DIY recipe. Um, but I think I'm actually going to go ahead and wrap this video up right here. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, you can go ahead and like button down below. If you want to see some more videos from me, you can go and subscribe. I post videos typically six days a week right now. If you are already subscribed and want notifications when I post, you can go ahead and hit that bell down below. Make sure that your YouTube notifications are turned on, and I will see you all in my very next video. Bye, lovelies.